Today we're going to configure the A8004-VE Axis Video Door Station to integrate with Axis Camera Station 5. So the first thing we need to do is add the door station. So we're going to click Add Edit Cameras. We're going to click Add to discover the door station, which is right here. We click Next. We're going to configure the recording later because one of the event rules that's automatically generated is to record every time the button on the door station has been uh, triggered. So we don't really need to configure motion or continuous recording with this device. Click Next. Finish. So now you can see the device has been added. So we're going to click Close. So if we go into the Live View, click in the A8004-VE, you can see it populates right here. Now the next thing we want to do is go under the Display Menu. Go to configuration, the event configuration, and under the advanced rules, you're going to automatically see that record ongoing call for the 8004 has automatically been generated, as well as the open door rule, which is going to create action buttons within Access Camera Station Live View of the 8004 to automatically open the door, end the call, answer a call. Those events are automatically created. But we want to create a new event. We're going to create an event to bring the 8004 to the front if you have access camera station minimized as well as an audio trigger so we're going to click add the 8004 is considered a device in access camera station so we're going to select device event we're going to select the 8004 the event is going to be a call state trigger period you can adjust to what you want but we're going to leave it at five seconds the source is going to be the door station Call state is going to be calling. You click OK and you click Next. Now, the action we're going to add is the first one we're going to do is Live View. So, the camera is going to be the 8004 VE and bring to the front. So, make sure this is checked off. On trigger, bring the application to the front. So, if you have the Access Camera Station software minimized and the door station is triggered, it's going to automatically uh, screen pop it onto the screen for you. We're also going to add a raise alarm rule. Let's click OK. Title is going to just be answer door. If you want to put an alarm procedure, you can. Click OK. Next. And the schedule is going to be always. You can create your own custom schedule. Maybe you want it 9 to 5, but generally you're going to want it as always. Click Next. You can name the rule A804-VE Rules. Click Finish. Now you can see the rules are here. You can always go back and modify them later. But we're going to click Close. To change the alarm notification sound, if you go into the sprocket and go into Customize, and then go into Notifications, you can select a custom sound by importing your own file. You can just have it be a simple beep or have no sound. Another thing you want to do is under the video and audio section, you want to make sure that under the A8004 that you have live view and recording checked off in audio to ensure that the audio from both the person at the door and the person at the desk is recorded if you want it recorded. So now, before we minimize the screen, if we hit the door station button, one, we got the alarm trigger, and two, you see you now have an answer button where you can have two-way communication. It's recording automatically. If we end the call, we can also trigger the door to open right from the video management software. But now, let's say that maybe this software is running on your secretary's uh, client PC, and it's minimized. So during the day, someone walks up to the door and pushes the button. You can see there's a screen pop automatically with Access Camera Station because we configured that event. And again, you can answer the door, end the call. Everything's been recorded. You can open the door. And now you have an access control solution. If you want to review the recordings, you just go into Recordings. And you can see that all the recordings from me hitting the button are right here. 
Another cool feature of Axis Camera Station 5 is that we now have a buffering, uh, buffering feature. So I can scroll through the recording to quickly search a video. But of course, this is just a quick access control event. So there's nothing really to search. Um, you can export from Axis Camera Station right here. So you can select the clip that you want, click Save. You can export it to a certain file. Uh, we're just going to have it go to the desktop for right now. You click Export. Clip has been exported. So if I was to go to my desktop, play the file, here it is right here. And that is how you configure the A8004 to integrate with Access Camera Station. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment at the bottom.